Hey everyone, Tim Schofield here. Today we're gonna take a look at a brand new pair of true wireless earbuds. This is the Nothing Ear One, yes, from a company called Nothing. Very interested to check these out. They look really cool. They're actually transparent and has a lot of features built in. It has active noise canceling. It has that transparency mode so you can hear things as well. The case also does charge wirelessly. And not only that, with all of those features, these actually cost $99. So let's open these up, take a quick look what we get in the box, and then check out the Nothing Ear Ones. Here they are, fairly simplistic box with a large earbud up towards the front. There's both of them, make note, red and white dots, depending on if it's the left or right earbud, so you don't have an L and an R, just making it a little bit easier, and there's that red dot. Let's go ahead and peel this open. A little bit of a different unboxing, usually... Uh, you don't have boxes like this. Usually you just slide it on open. So this is kind of neat getting a different experience. So now we're sliding open the box, but here are the Nothing Ear Ones with the transparent case. And we will take a look at them, see if anything else comes in the box. There are a few different things. First of all, in here, Nothing Ear One True Wireless Earbuds. Quick start guide, safety information, pretty standard. We've also got a nice sort of rubberized braided cable, USB type A to USB type C for charging. And again, this case does charge uh, via Qi wirelessly. And we also have earplugs. So medium is on already. And these are small and large. As you guys know, Got some big ears, so I'm definitely gonna have to put the large ones on. So on to what you came to see, the Nothing Ear Ones, peeling off this plastic. Make note, there is a button here, I believe, for pairing. You have a USB-C port for that charging. And just notice this is where the coil will be for that wireless charging down at the bottom. But kind of cool that you could see through into where the earbuds are. Opening it on up, there's an LED light there. Let's go ahead and take these out and show them off. So here is the Nothing Ear One, their first earbuds. So as I mentioned, the red and white dots, you're just gonna have to remember red means the left ear, white means the right ear. It does say Nothing Ear One on the outside. Cool, again, that you can see into the earbuds there. As you can tell, see all the tech that goes inside. And it does have kind of a white cap around it with the white gel tips, which I'm glad they went with the gel tips because the ones that aren't gel tips actually don't fit in my ears. And just one more close up of the earbud so you can take a look at how transparent it actually is. There are a bunch of mics built in. And let's go ahead and take off this gel tip so you can see that. I'm going to replace it anyways. Whoops. All right, so I've got the larger sized tips on there. Now let's get this synced up to my phone. Now these will work on Android or iOS. So setting them on in, closing the case, that uh, LED light is green, but let me grab my phone. Now there is an Ear One app that I have installed with nothing showing up. There are our earbuds join the improvement program you can allow location if you'd like to now hold the button on the side we will do that there they are let's get this all paired up and connected it does have fast pair if you use android that's in beta at the moment so that will be coming very soon so here's a quick tutorial for those gestures double tap play pause triple tap before next tap and hold will switch between that noise cancellation and transparency mode and slide on the stem volume up and down so I'm excited to test that out and make sure that does work. Let's hit start, gives me battery percentage of the case and both earbuds. So pretty simple enough, you have hear and touch. So let's customize our listening experience with these earbuds. With the noise cancellation, you have light or maximum. You can switch over to transparency or turn them both off if you'd like. There's also an equalizer. Doesn't look like you can truly customize it. You can just have more treble, more bass or voice. I wonder if they will add a completely fine tuning equalizer towards uh, a little bit later on. Next up, we have touch with our gesture controls, triple tap for next song, tap and hold for noise cancellation, and right ear, left ear, the same thing. If you want next song, you can actually customize them individually for previous song or next song. I might actually do left ear, previous song, which makes a lot of sense, and right ear will be the next song. 
All right, we're all ready to go. Let's go ahead and put these in our ears for the first time and actually give them a quick test. So let's try these on for the first time. One thing I'm noticing while holding the case is that there's a bit of an indent on the top, which kind of gives you a spot to comfortably hold it, kind of find myself playing around with the case, et cetera. Anyways, let's go ahead and try these on for the first time. Uh, pulling out red, which I'm realizing now earlier, I said red was the left one. Red is actually the right one, so sorry for confusing you. I'll make sure to make an annotation earlier on. So putting the right one in, and then the white one will be the left ear. A uh, bit of a chime, recognizing it goes in my ears. It does have a feature where if I take one out, it will pause my music or content, and if I put it back in, it will resume it automatically. Very comfortable, actually. First uh, impressions. I feel like I've got a little bit of strange ears overall, but uh, right now transparency mode is on. Uh, I can customize that again. I can press and hold here, and it turns on that noise cancellation now, so I can tell I'm not hearing my voice nearly as well. So here's just another look at them in my ears as I turn from left to right. Pretty cool, honestly. I'm a big fan of the design. I like how unique they are, really. Um, you don't see too many transparent, too much transparent tech around, so it's cool to see a company trying something new, trying something different. So now let's do a quick test. I have a song loaded up here. Let's do a double tap to play, and it is starting the song up. Now, I really want to test out the volume's kind of low right now. Let's go ahead and slide on the stem and slide up, and it is actually increasing the volume there. Oh, it's getting kind of loud. So it's not quite at 100% yet. Hopefully, I'm not screaming at the, at the camera right now, but let's go ahead and turn it down just a little bit. It seems to be pretty responsive going down and up as I'm sliding on the stem, so that's nice. I always like having volume controls without having to pull out my phone. I think that's a nice added touch. All right, so triple tap now on the right should skip the song. There you go, skips. And as you remember, I configured it. It restarted the song, as you guys know. So if you do want to go back a song, you have to go one, two, three, one, two, three. There we go, goes back. I, I, I really wish you could customize that part, but that's pretty consistent across the board. But anyways, in terms of initial impressions, they sound very good, especially for the price point that they hit at $99. So if I want to go ahead and press and hold, it should turn transparency mode on. There we go. So now I can really start to hear myself. And if I press and hold even this side, it should do the same thing. It should turn on that noise cancellation mode. So there we go. Uh, anyways, that's everything I want to talk about for now with the Nothing Ear One earbuds. Drop a comment. Let me know what you think. Let's go ahead and put these back in. Uh, as usual, it takes just a little bit to kind of remember how to actually put them back in, but I don't see any issues whatsoever because they do have magnets. This is not going to fly out of the case or anything like that, so it does stay secure in there, but we can just go ahead and close it on up. So I hope you enjoyed the video. Drop a comment. Let me know what you think about these earbuds. If you're planning to pick them up, be sure to give this video a thumbs up. Be sure to subscribe as well. A lot more content coming soon. As always, thanks for watching.